the fourth race of the 2014 International GT Open season was full of drama and entertainment from start to finish. The all Corvette front row of Maxime Soule and Nicky Pastorelli led the charge down to Turn 1. And it was the Salasat Racing Team Corvette of Soule that led through ahead of Daniel Zampieri who jumped into second and Archie Hamilton clambering into third. Niccolò Shiro in the Velorba Corsa Ferrari had a tolerant start to the race but not as bad as Giorgio Roda who took this early trip through the gravel trap. Roda's race then went from bad to worse after contact with the Sport and new Porsche. More problems further back for Stefano Costantini in the Ombra Racing Ferrari around. He went putting the car out of contention for GTS class Rostro. Well, Nicky Pastorelli soon moved back up into third position, moving clear of teammate Archie Hamilton with a nicely orchestrated manoeuvre into turn one. Hamilton looked to fight back, but in the end settled for following behind his teammate, but not for too long because Hamilton was quickly demoted by charging Michele Ruglo and Jose Perez Icar, the two Ferraris battling for the GTS class lead. Hamilton slipping down the order as that demoted him to sixth. Matt Griffin was doing all he could at the wheel of the AF Course Ferrari, making this pass on Dennis Rotera, who once more was struggling with mechanical issues. Well, the first half of the race was a high-speed game of chess between Maxime Soule and Daniel Zampieri, the pair of them circulating in formation as Nicky Pastorelli did all he could to close in on the leading duo. Despite the best effort, Zampieri, though, there was nothing he could do to overhaul the Salasat Racing Team Corvette, the winner of the first race of the weekend here in Portimao. Maxime Soule seems as he was having to drive within himself a little bit to make sure he conserved the life of his Dunlop tyres. That gave Zampieri, therefore, the slightest opportunity. He was there and ready to pounce. Soule experienced enough never to present such a moment. Well, as ever, the mid-race pit stops, turning the race in its head, and one of the first to pit in was Nicolo Shiro in the Velorba Course Ferrari to hand over to the very rapid Andrea Montermini. Unsurprisingly, Maxim Soule and Daniel Zampieri aimed to stay out as late as possible into the pit window, but they found themselves up on the tail of Cedric Spezioli in the AF Course Ferrari, who had pitted early, was running at a comparable pace. Stefano Constantini, Joel Camathius getting a little bit too tight into the Turn 5 hairpin. The next to blink was Nicky Pastrelli. He came in to hand over to Miguel Ramos, looking to win here at his home track for the third year in a row. Daniel Zampieri was in to hand over to Roman Mavlanov. And once the pit stop success penalties had played themselves out, an anticipated Mavlanov would emerge in the lead of the race. He did just that, but Ramos was charging behind, making this move on Claudio Sedanvitz to elevate himself up into second position. Sprizioli was in fine form on his international GT Open debut, darting to the inside of Joel Kamathius. This was the moment on which the race turned, a puncher for Mavlanov, forcing him back into the pits and promoting Miguel Ramos into the lead of the race. Well, at mid-race, it looked it was the perfect day for the SMP Russian Bears team in command of the race overall and the GTS class. This pit stop cost them the race overall, as the fight for third was frenetic. And Andrea Montermini and Isaac Tatumlu, the pair of them, Elbow to elbow, but that uncharacteristic error from a Termini gave to Tumlu the opening that he needed to dart through. Termini having to delve deep into his bag of tricks to find a way ahead of Tatumlu. Eventually, he was aided though by this spin from Vashlav Melev, putting Melev out of the lead of the GTS class, Tatumlu taking evasive action, and Montermini promoted up onto the rostrum. So it was victory for Miguel Ramos and Nicky Pastorelli, their second triumph of the season. It was the first trip to the roster of the season for their V8 Racing teammates, Diedrich Shitoff and Archie Hamilton, with Andrea Montermini and Nicolo Shiro completing the podium. The GTS class claimed by Michele Rugolo and Claudio Sadanvich. 
delighted Ramos and Pastrelli celebrating on the top step of the podium. So Damage and Rugolo likewise in the GTS class. It was a great race.